Hey, what's up guys? Back with another video here. Today I'm going to show you a couple of tricks that, that will impress, impress your friends. Personally, me at school, I impress my friends a couple of times. Sometimes I try to do some new tricks so they don't just see the boring tricks I do every single time. So, in this video I'm going to show you a couple of tricks that will help you impress your friends. So, these tricks might take some practice, but in a couple of weeks you're going to be able to do it. So let's get into it. So our first trick is the rainbow to around the world. What's really to learn about this trick is the straighter your ball is, the better and easier it is to get your foot sole and then you to do your around the world. So if it's so if it's here, you're gonna have to do a full turn, and we don't want that. But if it's just straight from here to here, then it's just easy to get. Because if you know how to move your leg. And if you have a good balance, you're going to be able to do your around the world and you're done your trick. So our second trick is the rainbow to the neck. So what's really to learn about this trick is where are you gonna put it? So if, if so if you do your rainbow from here, so if so if this foot is from here, then the ball's gonna go that way. So you're gonna have to move your body there. So if it's gonna go left, you're gonna move your body this way, and you have to go left. But so I think the easiest way for me is to do right in the middle like this. So like this, when it goes high, you don't have to move a lot. Just either need it's gonna go up. All you need to do is maybe to move a little straight, and you got your shot. So our last trick is called the hand capture. So this trick isn't all that easy to learn because usually when your ball goes up in the air you're gonna have to know exactly when to tighten your hands so when to go like this and also when the what and plus you're gonna have to do this an exact at an exact timing and you're gonna have to know exactly when the ball drops because if you do it before the ball's just gonna drop flat so it so usually the ball is gonna have to come maybe when the ball comes exactly there when you know that the ball is gonna come you you close it as fast as you can you can't do it after it has to be before because by the time you're gonna go like this the ball's already gonna come in your hands so 